status bars and notification panels have been of great importance and use for the Android users since the very beginning of Android itself. They not only change the view and functionality of Android but even bring a new dimension to it. So here we are, make it look and feel and function even better. Let's get started with the tutorial. Editing and customizing the look and feel of your status bars as well as notification drawers isn't way too difficult. We have certain apps in the Play Store that are gonna help us and in this video tutorial we are gonna take a look at the top 3 of them which will help you customize your status bar the way you want. The first app is called One Tap Quick Bar. This is available free on the Google Play Store. What you can do is you can click on new and there you have the list of all those toggles you can add slide to the right and you have all those apps installed on your Android device which you can also add to the notification panel then you can even add the shortcuts as well as contacts now let's start with the editing you can add a maximum of six items per row of your status bar and then you can even customize the design of the background you want you can set up a transparent background a white one and so on I'll put the transparent one for the time being click OK and finally you need to click apply and boom right there you have your notification toggles that you wanted to set up right there now since this is the free version you can only set up a single row but if you were interested and want to have more customizing options you can go for the premium one so that was a quick look on how to customize and add notification toggles as well as apps right in your notification bar the next thing we are gonna do is add this thing in our status bar now this is actually the MIUI type of battery indicator this shows the amount of battery that is left on your device if it's on 100% this line is gonna go till the end and slowly as your battery decreases it's gonna shift towards the left the app that is gonna help us accomplish our task is called charge bar again this is available free on the Google Play Store you click on on you can choose if you want start on boot or not you can hide it in full screen apps or if you want to show it up then you can even animate the charge bar right there when it's charging it is gonna show go like boom 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 you know while it's charging then you can even change the background color if you want to let me set it to something like red and click ok and right there I have it set to red then you can even change the height actually it's not height it's width let's set it to 5 I click on done and right there you see it just increases the thickness I think 2 would be much better yeah that's cool and then you can even change the position of this bar you can set it to the top to the bottom right there the, the top of system bar and then bottom of status bar right there I prefer it to be on the top right there then you can even change the animation style you want to this is the default one then you have the inverted one which will start from right and the and as the battery decreases it is gonna shift towards right then you can keep it centered it will decrease like this you know finally it will come to the center as the battery dies default one and that was a quick look at charge bar the last app and the app that is going to customize your status bar to a really great extent is called super status bar you click it on and right there it just changes the whole look of your status bar let me just show you again you see this is my default status bar I switch it on and boom you see I get this really slick looking status bar then I need to switch on the accessibility I have a couple of settings again I can start on boot I have the static notification option then I can even set up a custom background or IL3 background which only works with static backgrounds 
anyways let's get back and you have this elements option wherein you can customize individual elements the way you want to you have the battery you see if you click on text visible if you switch it on I have the text on my battery that shows how much amount of battery I have I'll switch it off for the time being then you can disable it just by making the icon invisible then you have the juice visible then you can even change the font you want to you can select the text color if you want to change to and another good thing is that you have the MIUI bar that works like charge bar which we reviewed just a couple of minutes ago then you even have this animated battery option let's get back and check out some other stuff let's get to notification okay I have the icon this almost it's almost the same things you have the you can change the text font the text color the pop-up the custom background now let's get back and let's check out the advanced tab you can choose what custom layout you want you have a couple of them custom classic center clock classic inverted custom with carrier other stuff let us check out classic inverted I think the battery yeah see the battery goes to that side and you know this notification comes in right there then you can even ena enable the root mode and other stuff so that was a quick look at super status bar which takes customizing your status bar as well as the notification panel to a new level so that was a really quick tutorial on how to customize your status bars the way you love if you do like my efforts the video and the apps do give a thumbs up you can subscribe to my channel if you want to watch more Android videos and you got any questions any queries about Android and stuff you can comment in the comment section down below I hope to see you in my next video till then play safe and goodbye